はようございます。こんにちは。こんばんは。おやすみなさい。いただきます。ごちそうさまでした。We learn many words by now. That's really good. So today, look at this. It's so many celebration in Japan on May 5th. It's so interesting to learn another country has a different custom. We'll see today. Oh my goodness, this is,、um, we learned a couple、uh, videos、uh, before, previous video. So, samurai helmet. They have to prepare end of April. So, what we're gonna do on May 5th. Is actually the children's day. What they're gonna do? Let's learn today. It's so,、uh, oh my goodness, this mochi. Have you seen this mochi? I have to explain before、uh, we learn. Where is my pen? Where it goes? Yes. This is kashiwa mochi and、uh, this is chimaki, also chimaki. And this is a samurai helmet.、Uh, this is a shobuyu. Taking a bath with plant. So, this mochi, we learn,、um, kusa mochi and、uh, hanami dango. It's sweet rice dumpling. It's so many mochi. But when I go to maybe Costco and a Trader Joe's, even they do have mochi ice cream these days. And、um, when you, of course, you go to Japanese market, you can see actually you can purchase. This Kashiwa Mochi and Chimaki, but the Costco and the Trader Joe's major American supermarket, they do have a mochi ice cream, I saw, and mochi donuts. <laughs> It's so good, tastes so good. I don't know healthy or not, but I saw so many mochi products you might purchase, you might try to eat. <laughs> That's I just wanted to tell you. Alright, l so this shobu yu is shobu is Japanese iris. So not the flower, actually the leaf. They put it in,、uh, you know, warm water when you're taking a bath. You kind of smells like、uh, it's leaves good. And also this is med- medication for the skin is smooth. It's, and also this leaf shape is sword. This. When the evil comes, To you, you can kind of fight with sword. Maybe that's why they use the leaves. In many reasons to fight against the evils. And this is mochi. Is kashiwa mochi is eating. People eat, it's especially Tokyo side, east side of Japan. And this chimaki is western side of Japan, like Osaka and Kyoto. They eat chimaki, but these, these days, They kind of mixed up, but they used to different shape, different kind of mochi they eat. Okay, kashiwa mochi usually, usually they do have a red bean, sweet red beans inside. Mmm, looks good. And a chimaki has a, a sweet rice dumpling. It's covered with bamboo leaf. Kashiwa mochi is covered with Japanese oak leaf. It's both, they do have a bactericide action. So that's why they keep fresh and moist. And it smells good, leaves, especially bamboo leaves smells really good. Okay, this is Gogatsu Ningyo.、Uh, prepare end of、uh, April to、um, May 5th. So actually you can see this is chimaki. And you can see this is kashiwa mochi. They put on so many decorations. So it's each decoration has meaning, but it's explained too much. But、uh, boys, especially this is boys celebration to grow strong and healthy. That's the, you know, main reason. Alright, koi no bori is carp strainer. We did this in the previous video too. And you can see the order. It's beautiful. Blue sky. And you can see koi no bori is 
in the ocean, the ocean in the sky. This has many five colors is on top. This is gold. And the first black one is dead. That's the father. And the second red one is mom, mothers. And the third, this is a kid. Sometimes you can see green ones underneath. So many kids. That's the order when you see. Okay, I saw in somewhere in the United States is, you know, koinobori. Some people are doing in the yard. Maybe they bought it in Japan. I don't know. Probably you may see too. Okay, today's student is Mia-san. Ogenki desu ka, Mia-san? I'm not gonna write anymore. Hai, genki desu? Or, ie, genki deba arimasen. Because you already know these two sentences when I ask. So I change. I'm gonna show you today's menu, kyo no menu. What you're gonna learn today is first of all, of course, you have to do meditation. Meditate is very important before and after learn. And the second of all is shakyo. We're gonna learn this kanji one at a time. And conversation, that's also just one word. And that learn, one word you learn, you are able to read and right and four and five fifth is review so we learn something i just give you a quiz and after that the meditation is done how is going today so it looks good let's go okay this is koinobori it's beautiful it's I wish we could, you know, like a carp. Oh my goodness, it's really comfortable. Let's say together before lesson, Yoroshiku Onegai Shimasu. That's also carp is hanging in a beautiful flower. I, I, I think this is a mini cherry blossoms or peach or plum, maybe. All right, let's do meditation together before lesson. Let's inhale and exhale. Try not to think about the others you worry. Just inhale. Concentrate your breathing. Exhale. And inhale one more time. And exhale. Shakyo time. Let's learn Shakyo one kanji at a time. Today we're gonna learn this kanji. Alright, let's see how to write. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Let's count to Japanese. 1,2,3,4,5,6,7,8,9,10,11 How is the writing? Alright, let's write with your pen. Do you have a kami? Let's see, you can write or not. Now first of all, before we write, do you see this three dot in the left side? We learned before this kanji I explained to you. This is a wave. Do you remember? We did a wave kanji. So this means related with some moist and water. When you, you see this is, of course, wave is in ocean. That's why you have a three dot. This has a three dot is related with water. This means is deep. Deep in the ocean, deep in the water. That's the deep meaning. That's why they have a one, two, three. Okay, let's write together. One, each, ni, san, shi, 
五を六七八九十十一 Was it difficult? I don't think so. You could do it. Alright, we did this meaning deep. It's shim, but sometimes, this time we read jin. Gyo jin. Jin. Okay, we don't have to read about the writing. When you do shakyo, you have to, you know, memorize or kind of you know how to write. Otherwise, it's difficult when you use this fudepe and writing all this difficult kanji. Try memorize. Conversation time. So, we're gonna learn today one word. Oh my goodness, this is, I'm asking Mia-san all the time. Do you have an inpitsu? Do you have, what is this? Paper in Japanese. What do you say? Yes, that's right. Kami desu. I'm gonna change the color. Kami desu. Paper in Japanese is kami. And also this hair, this is also kami too. The same word that the two meaning. Paper and hair, this is kami. I'm gonna, kami is, did you cut your hair? Is kami kitta. <laughs> kami kitta. Is did you cut your hair? You remember this one's kitta. Did you cut? Cut is kiru. Kami kitta. If you said kami kitta, means you're asking, did you cut your hair? And also this is paper or on the same thing, kami. Do you have a paper or kami arimasu ka? Yes, mia -san. I'm gonna ask you, what is this? Kore wa nan desu ka? What are you gonna say? Yes. Kami desu. Kami desu. Very good. Always this end of the sentence. Alright, we can see paper again. So, what is this paper? Yes, that's right. You can read. That's your turn to speak. Yes, kami this. Okay, now we can read kami and writing. Let's find out kami in this chart. Where is ka? That's right. Where is mi? Yes, it is. That's it. Ka, mi, that's two letter. You can read. That's kami. We didn't use this dot. And uh, not this chart today. So let's review. Yomu is kaku. What is this? Anata. Watashi. Anata is you. Watashi is me or I. And what is this? Seito. Student. Sensei. Teacher. Namae. Yes, that's the name. What is this? Hom is a book. Yes, that's the long one. Kempo u. What is Kempo? Kine bi. Kempo is constitution. Kine bi is Memorial Day. Remember that? And today we learn kami, paper and hair. Let's Kaku, writing. So you are able to write, anata, watashi, seito, sensei, namae, hom, kenpo, kinenbi. Wow, that's a lot you could write. And today let's write it down together. Ka, mi. How is your writing? Let's see. Again, <laughs> we can see paper. Too many today. You won't forget. All right. 
クイズの時間です。is time for quiz now. I'm gonna give you two questions. これは何ですか ?What is this? You can answer in Japanese. You already know. That's right. 紙です。Very good. How about this one? That's the hint.、Um, May 3rd, Constitution Memorial Day in Japanese, please. That's right. 憲法記念日です。Always this. 憲法記念日です。Good. Okay. So now is end of the lesson. Let's do meditate together and it feels good. Have some green tea. Yes. Have some chimaki. And kashiwa mochi. Origami paper over there, they made a helmet. Very good. Alright, close your eyes and inhale and exhale. One more time. Inhale, exhale. Sometimes you can see this video outside. Looks like goodbye time, Mia san. I am going to ask you, Mia san. Sayonara, Mia san. Mata laishu. So, Mia san, you're gonna say to me, My name is Crescenta Mom Sensei. Sayonara, Kiku Sensei. Mata laishu. Very good. So I put over here is Shakyo's learn. No, Shakyo's, not Shakyo's learn. Shakyo, we learn one kanji at the Shakyo. So you can see, visualize, you won't forget. Three dots. What's the meaning? What's the related? Yes, that's the water and moist. Alright, after a lesson, let's say it together. Arigato gozai mashita. That's very good. Okay, let's eat together. Maybe eating chimaki and kashiwa mochi. This time a lots of mochi. Let's go to Casco, get a mochi ice cream. Okay, mata laishu.